Welcome to Unilag TV News. My name is Abimbola Adelaku. We begin with Nugu updates. The quarterfinals football match was a tough one as Team Unilag and Team UI were both determined to come out victorious. The atmosphere at Sports Center was filled with so much anticipation as the fans of UI did not only come with trumpets to cheer their players, but with a coffin to signify their victory over Team Unilag. Reverse was the case in the second half as a solitary goal from Oluwashim Oluwadumila gave Team Unilag a spot in the semi-final of the ongoing 2022 Nugu Games. Still a Nugu update, on the 23rd of May, the University of Lagos held the scientific conference themed Prepositioning Institutional Sports for Excellence National and Global Impact. The event began with the opening speech of the Vice Chancellor, Professor Oluwatoin Ogundikbe, who was represented by the Deputy Vice Chancellor of Development Services, University of Lagos, Professor Ayodele Victoria Asenua. The conference was very enlightening and informative as it addressed sensitive topics such as mental health and drug abuse. There were different sessions and briefings, and finally, the closing speech by Professor Ayodele Asenua. In education, Oni of Ife Obadeyeye Ogungusi has cautioned Ife indigents and residents protesting against the appointment of Adibayo Bamire as the Vice Chancellor of Obafemi Awolowa University, Ileife, against unlawful acts. This came after the disruption caused by the protesters in the school. The monarch promised the protesters that their agitations would be given adequate attention. He also assured workers and students of the institution of the safety of their lives and property. Still in education, the National Commission for Colleges of Education, NCCE, has said it would begin to clamp down on existing illegal colleges of education across the country. The Executive Secretary of the Commission, Professor Paulinus Okwele, made this disclosure in Abuja during the National Summit themed Nigeria Certificate in Education, The Way Forward. According to Okwele, Despite adequate human and material resources, the decreasing turnout of students is contributing to the low capacity delivery experience in the colleges of education. And in entertainment, Aloko Ahmed Adekunle is a 400 level student of the Department of Adult Education. He's an Afro vibe musician who gets his inspiration from life and his personal experiences. In the music industry, he looks up to top artists such as Whiskey and Barry J. To know about this music artist, check out his Instagram page at call underscore me underscore links. And that's it on Unilag TV News. Feel free to subscribe to our YouTube channel and click the notification bell to get updates on all our videos. Now, don't forget to also follow us across all social media platforms at Unilag on TV. Many thanks for watching. My name is Abimbola Adira. Good day.